Hi folks, and welcome to another quick, simple and easy for one meal. Just upscale the ingredients for two or more people. Today, I'm cooking a mouth-watering piece of boneless pork shoulder. It's seasoned with butter, salt and black pepper. And cooked in a roasting bag using the Corsori Dual Blaze. Guaranteeing, even cooking and crispy crackling. It's a simple yet flavorful dish that you'll surely love. Here's what you'll need for this recipe. A piece of boneless pork shoulder. One roasting bag. This one I'm cooking today weighs approximately just over 2 pounds or 0.965 grams. To get crispy crackling as the pork cooks, it will render the fat out of the skin and encourage it to blister. Make sure you have scored the skin with a sharp knife and be careful not to go through to the meat. This will help the fat escape during the cooking process. Put the meat into a roasting bag and securely tie the end. Then, put the pork shoulder into the air fryer basket and ensure the bag doesn't touch the top element. If the roasting bag is close to the top heating element, flip the crisper plate over to create more space. Set your kasori to air fryer mode and the temperature of 150C and the timer for 1 hour. Quickly check to ensure everything's okay, and return the meat to the air fryer. Set the temperature again to 150C and the timer for 1 hour, so the cooking time is, in total, 2 hours. Just make sure none of the cooking bag touches the upper element. Your boneless pork shoulder joint is ready. Be careful, it will be very hot, and so will the juices, so place everything in a dish before removing the cooking bag, and you'll not get burnt. Here's a simple way to open the bag without making a mess. Just grab a pair of scissors and snip off the top part of the bag. Then, you can easily peel off the bag from the food inside. That's it, you're almost ready to enjoy your meal. Now place the meat back into the air fryer basket for that all important crackling. Don't toss out the meat juices. They're awesome for making gravy. Just save them in a bowl or something and follow the steps on the gravy jar to whip up some yummy sauce for your roast. For a more healthy style gravy let the fat settle out first. Set the temperature to 185 C or 365 Fahrenheit for 10 minutes. To get crispy crackling as the pork cooks, it will render the fat out of the skin and encourage it to blister. Make sure you have scored the skin with a sharp knife and be careful not to go through to the meat. This will help the fat escape during the cooking process. And 7 minutes later, we have perfectly crispy crackling, delicious. Take the meat from the basket and put it on a warm plate. Wrap it up in some foil and rest it for 10 minutes. Now, it's time to start carving. Personally, I like thicker slices of meat, as you can see, and I also like crispy crackling on the top of my meat. Pork is cheap, versatile, tender and full of flavor. You can roast it as I have here, grill it, fry it, or stew it. You can pair it with potatoes, rice, vegetables, or salad. You could spice it up with herbs, sauces, marinades, or rubs. No matter how you cook it, pork will satisfy your hunger and your taste buds. So go ahead and treat yourself.
Now it's taste test time. This is absolutely gorgeous. Succulent, full of flavor and very, very, Moorish. Let's try a bit of crackling. I hope you're hearing this. It tastes great. I love the sound and the texture of a good crackling. Nothing beats it. The crunchiness of a piece of crispy pork skin. Roasted to perfection. It's one of my favorite treats. So there it is. Pork shoulder cooked to perfection in the Corsori Dual Blaze Air Fryer. This piece of pork shoulder cost just £5.12p. It will easily feed three people with some leftovers. That is, without question, value for money. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.